I, I don't understand the. I don't understand the point of it that you would take time and money out of your day to create a website where you could judge games and their community. It doesn't matter what community you have. It just doesn't matter. There, there is going to be some kind of like you could find negative stuff in anything, anything and everything. Anything. Even people that collect like butter dishes. The fuck you talking about? All right. I, I'm just saying like they, they get fighting and all that stuff like that. It's just one of those things that happens. People who collect butter dishes. Okay, listen. All right, right. Yeah, there's a whole club out there. Also, like, let's go back what? a little bit. Just recently, the what? pink Stanley Cup stuff, where women okay. were fighting, cussing, screaming at each other just to get their hands on a Target brand only Starbucks pink okay. Stanley Cup. Yeah, that makes more sense than butter dishes. Come on, man. You never had it. You don't have a nice butter dish at home. No. All right. No. People but yes, do fight I, over butter dishes. That's what I'm saying. No, no. No, the they butter don't. dish community is savage. See? No. I no. know what's going on. No. The chat is talking about butter dishes. Trent, <laughs> Trent Noir? Trent Noir? Trent Noir for a ten ninety. Golden Nuggets for a $2. I don't know what this stream is. Jeremy, send help. Uh, he's yeah, gone. It's pretty um, bad. Yeah. This show stinks. I don't know. Discount superhero for 24 months. <laughs> yeah. How do you know about my butter dish collection? Um, I don't know. Sir Hat for $2. Men who have butter dishes say, what's your sign? Probably. Uh, sure. Just, just for, like, we're not going to get into this, but just for the record, like there's even the best butter dishes for fresh spreadable butter recommended by the pros. You know, there's a whole list here of which one, you know, that's the best one, best value. All right. There you go. Just just so you know. Okay. Look, look at all those butter dishes that people collect. Can I get it on Amazon? It's important to the community. All right? That's all I'm saying. My grandma had tons of them, you know? Every time I went over to eat, it was a different butter dish. So it was like, you know, and then, I don't know. I don't know what happened to them all, to be honest with you. If you have a sincere, thoughtful opinion, those things are insignificant because what really matters is that you're a fucking dweeb. You're a fucking loser, dude. You're a grown-ass adult. You have bills to pay. Responsibilities. And you have gone out of your way to say something about your fucking nerd. Give me your lunch money. Lance Corporal Waffles for a 199. It says, butter dishes for life, you weak figs. Thank you. Al Favre for a $5. If your butter dish is anything except a paper plate, you're a fig. <laughs> uh, Osmora for 12 months. The Joker has the biggest collection of butter dishes. Uh, Arnold Womley for another 199 says the 199 demands articulate J butter plates. Oh. J? Uh, what are you doing, J? J is convinced that people collect butter butter plates they do like they collect like popcorn buckets butter popcorn it's plates. butter dishes man like people collect butter dishes and that community is very toxic that's all i'm saying yeah i don't well, know what you think the toxicity rating is uh, <laughs> i was giving it like a 75 80 75 80 so, right, yeah <laughs> higher than call of duty damn yeah that's respectable. but it's you, you guys all have butter dishes right no no you no. don't have a butter dish in your house no. How many butter no. dishes do you, you have you in your butter? house is what I'm trying to find out now. Yeah. I just take it out of the fridge. Like yeah. you just put it on a fucking have... plate and leave it. Like you just like Yeah. Not all of us get to show up in Corvettes and have fucking butter dishes, okay? Jay's sitting around in his dishes. fucking big ass chair getting tea and he's like, bring my butter dish. Like, <laughs> not that one. Yeah, bring the nice ones. So. Y'all are like some unclassy. Yeah, that's what like, we're saying, yeah. Jay. Yeah, Under, we are. Like, how do y'all not have a butter from you, Alabama? You buy butter in a tub or something? I yeah. at least get Kerrygold butter. We, ba but I just we bathe in the, in the butter. Listen, Listen, I, I, I what kind of butter do you use? Got to have a butter dish somewhere. Uh, probably <laughs> something that's lactose intolerant <laughs> because I'm lactose intolerant. And yeah, CJ, you know, now you made it. Now you hurt. Please, you made it obvious. Uh, you made it weird. You made it weird, Jay. You made it that weird. alternative thanks, butter. Thanks, What's that called? Thanks, like margarine. How many butter dishes do you have, Jay? Like, what do you you collect butter dishes? They're really awesome, man. You yeah, gotta see your collection. Weird. Yeah, the fact no, that he gonna, knows that there's a community and they're toxic. Steal it. 
Why would I steal your? Wow. Oh, okay. <laughs> because you don't have wow. it. Black people steal stuff. Got gotcha, you, wow. Okay. Sorry, I, I don't want that. you looking what? at my fine no. china because you might steal it, huh? I didn't <laughs> even know what a butter dish is. <laughs> I know what a butter dish Jay's is, Jay, but apparently I'm just going to steal everybody's fucking again. butter dishes. Jay's. That's all I'm doing. <laughs> all right, moving on. I can't believe you right. excuse me of trying to steal your fucking butter dishes, man. Like... Jay's Asian son for a 199. Oh, God, says, here we go. Love you too, Dad. Thanks. The butter um, burglar. <laughs> Jay, when was your last midnight release? Uh, I never did that crap. Whoa. <laughs> Damn. Whoa. Man, I, I was poor. I couldn't do that stuff, man. I didn't have any money. <laughs> no, I, you know what? Going to a midnight release when you're poor is like going to the ice cream man. We have no oh. money, and all your kid, all your well, friends. Well, listen, bought Jay. Ice all you do is steal a couple of butter and you just dishes, stand and you're fine. There hoping that they had a couple of extra no, change in their just, pocket, and they buy you an ice cream cone. It you was just awful. steal a couple it's butter dishes, feeling. bro. Man, you get a little change. Up at a C8 Corvette uh, to the meetup with a well, hot chick. Well, that was a different time. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm gonna steal Jay's butter dishes when I get a chance. So, um, hey, thank you guys for having me. I'm gonna leave now. Take it easy. <laughs> Yeah, fucking stupid man. Now, what the fuck, bro? Fucking stupid man. I don't know who did that. Stupid man. Fuck, bro. Holy shit. <laughs> Eric's never coming back on this show. He's like, they don't do that at the Blaze. <laughs> I have all of them. <laughs> Krista, what the fuck, man? <laughs> it's my fart soundboard. I'm all, don't tell Mike, though. We're going to oh, do it every time he comes here. Lance Corporal Waffles for another 199. Show me your finest butter dish, Jay. Uh, eventually, I I'll get it out. Alpha Ray for a five dollars. I wish I would have sent more, but I'm saving up for a new butter dish. Stop picking on Beardo; he's gonna flip out and wipe everyone's ass. Mm. <laughs> uh, Eric K for a two. Give me back my butter dish. Flag Ninja for a five. Let's talk butter dishes. Epic Mike's stolen butter dish collection for a one nine nine. Mike's fart got him caught stealing butter dishes. <laughs> Uh, John Mellick for 22 months. I've covered, I have a covered dish for butter, Jay. Forget these peasants. Jay's half Asian son for a $2. By the way, dad, I found some butter dishes. You want? Andre CR for a 2,500 in checks is, uh, Vara, how many butter dishes do you have? I don't know what the reference is, but zero. It, it's honestly, as much as it seems like a meme, uh, Jay like has this fascination with butter dishes, and we're like, none of us have a butter dish. We just buy you butter. Know. Are we talking store. like butter bells, where you put the water at the bottom and no, then you no, put no. the butter like, in? You or buy or a you stick of about... butter, you put it in a dish, and it sits out on your counter. Yeah, that's, yeah, I don't do that. Yeah, do you I have just, one of those? That's weird. <laughs> yes, exactly. It's exactly. Butter that's fucking disgusting. <laughs> no, it's not. It's like a yeah, whole it community. Is. There's no, a whole it's community. Not. Like these things. There's a oh, furry yeah, community send too. Send me the Facebook group to the community. <laughs> yeah. I want to see the proof that this community exists. <laughs> Jay was saying in. that people collect butter dishes as much as Stanley cups. Like this whole Stanley cup craze oh, where people no, are like lining up outside of cups. Target for days for because hours. they want to. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, uh, look at the chat. It's going crazy. They're amazing. I have three or four. Yeah. Oh, he fell all, all two of them. Not all here. two comments. The chat's going crazy. What the heck is I'm pulling up tons of them. So, okay, so actually, uh, corn. My, my, my parents did have a butter bell growing up. The one where it's like, butter it bells looks like, cool. yeah, yeah. So yeah, yeah. it looks like a bell. You stick the butter in it and you put a little yeah. bit of water at the bottom at of the it. At the bottom keep, so it locks it, it, it so moist. it seals it. Yep, yeah. so it seals it and I, doesn't go bad. I don't know why you just wouldn't have butter in the butter container and then take some butter out when you need it like a normal person. Because that's like, yeah. but that butter's filled with like all kinds of terrible... And look what at you, Kevin, two hundred. What are you talking about? The same butter, butter that you're eating. What do you mean? It's bad butter. It's, it's just butter. I just keep sticks this of butter nothing, in the fridge, and I use it when I want it. This has nothing to do with Jay, and he still claims it's his. Thank you, Kevin, for two hundred dollars. <laughs> Thank you, Kevin, for the two hundred. And, and it's not. It has nothing to do with Jay, by the way. Kevin.
it for two hundred dollars. He does. Has nothing to do with Jay. He didn't even take time to put your name in the super chat. He yeah, because Jay. he was so upset at your butter dish. I don't know. I was wondering where you were going with that one. I was like, Hate. where are you going with this one? The butter dish. Like, look at this right here. Like this is this is like beautiful. Can someone like send this to me? Look at this. This is a thousand dollar butter. Oh dish right hell here. Oh. no! Oh, look at that on. with a kind of fucking butt that plug is. on top. Every time you want to use <laughs> butter, you got to grab a butt plug. Gross. That That's is a flower. The and, ugliest uh... piece of silver I've ever seen. Yeah, I'm not. Why would you want that? That's what poor people say. <laughs> come, on, come on, come on, Beardo. Beardo, hold on, hold on. Before you continue, one last, one last one. You don't, you don't want this, man. You wouldn't want this in your house. I mean, that is cool. See, that's see. Cool. It's so but lazy, though. Why is the bottom part white and not like green for grass it's or something? Perfect. Lazy. That's, that's if you want you thirty dollars, if you want thirty freaking dollars for this, you need to paint it properly. Yeah, paint it like it a pokeball. A you don't want to paint yeah. it yellow because it, it takes sense. away from the no, yellow. No, but you paint it green, like he's laying on like a a grassy hill. See, Thank yes. You. Yes, Thank perfect. You. That's all I need to know. Disco Cobra 50! 50! Woo! Jay is the most sophisticated of all of us, the high class uh, society. We brokies must bow to our overlords and accept that we will never live up to the standards. Please, Jay, don't be so hard on Jeremy or Beardo, uh, for they lack the knowledge. Look at mm. that. True. Thank you, Jay, for blessing us with your presence. Well, one last mm -hmm. thing, and then we'll go up, move on. Look at these butter dishes, man. There's a oh. pig. Oh, my God. Those are the ugliest fucking Look things I've ever things, seen in my man. life. <laughs> those are Look ugly. That. Look at this one. The Corn Bell Silver Company. Looks like it just Jay. someone took it from the Titanic. A cow. Jay, a you cow. realize you could go buy retro video games instead of butter dishes? Right? Like, there are a hundred different things uh, you can buy I'm a digital downloader. I'm not really a, you know... So if it's Damn. on Switch, I'll get it. Naaman's the retuber for a five dollars beardo. God sent me to tell you that butter dishes are peak tea. Bless you. I hey, thank you for the five. Stitch for a two. Stop, stop the butter dish hate. Uh, Thundarius for nine months. Butter dishes are popular in the Midwest with farm families. Keeps the butter spreadable versus being cold hard stick like the one up beardo's ass over John. Damn. <laughs> Damn, that was good. Damn, I that thought we were good. cool, Thundarius. E send for a five dollars. Butter dishes are great. Room temperature butter is so easy to spread on toast. It's a lot of butter $2. talk. Yeah. Butter butter. Butter butter. Um nom 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 nom. Thank you, Moose. Now I want to know if they do have like a Trump butter dish or something like that, you know? Elsa Barrett for twenty dollars. A word without a world without butter dishes is a butter dish topia. <laughs> Thank you, Elsa Barrett. Alpha Ray for a five dollars. That's exactly how a butter dish should look. If you have one, um, you should have to squat on it like a fig to get out the butter. Damn. A uh, hot dice for three months. If you spread cold butter out of your fridge over your toast, you're a knuckle draggy. Uh, you're a knuckle dragger. Get a butter dish. Thanks for the three months. Uh, Saying Adam for twelve months. Cold butter is low class. I mean, you can Holy warm it up a little shit. bit. This butter discussion has created a firestorm. Does, does everybody have butter on the mind? Yeah, though? man. Uh, hey. Laura Lynn lands for a five dollars. Love you, Jay Bear smooches. I have a butter dish too. You can't make everyone happy. <laughs> I like watching people play conservative games. Hail the one and nine and be blessed. Buttergate. Uh, <laughs> suicidal cynic for a five dollars. I don't care about the dish. Just give me that butter unbreaded. Oh my people in the butter. Do people like, like not remember what happened? They were putting butter dishes in every microwave. Sneaking into homes. Masked up, of course. Democrats. I stay six feet away from you while I burgle your house. And by burgle, I mean your butthole. And they put the butter dishes in. People died. George Bush lied. Commies cried. People died from butter dishes on 9-11-2020. Anyway, T Man 2442 says, Ever try a butter bell? It's far superior to your average butter dish. You know why I love the internet? Do you know why? I am learning that there are echelons of butter dishes out there. I'm just a look, I my friends describe me as bougie. 
You know why? Because I won't stay at an Econo Lodge. Like, well, there's only nine of us. We can probably all fit in a day's in. No. I don't want to be anywhere near any of you people. All in like you mean one room at a day's in? Am I buying an entire day's in? No. Why don't we just get a better hotel room? I don't know, closer to what we're doing. Because you picked a day's in in Iowa. They describe me as bougie for this. Like, look, when I go out in the woods, I just want to sleep on a Tempur-Pedic mattress at night. And I just want Jorge to read me stories in Espanol. Like, I want that to happen, and I will pay extra for it. But I'm learning now that I'm just a normal plebeian Walmart shopper, Target shopper, when it comes to butter dishes. There's a whole world of butter dishes that I didn't know about. I feel like I've been lied to the entire time. Buy CNN. I really love butter, but I really hate butter. So I know this is a tangent and I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. When I married Lady Raggets, I didn't actually eat much real butter back then because my parents were lazy, heretical monsters. And they, they ate a beautiful thing. It was a partly hydrogenated vegetable oil called country crock. Now I know you RNs in the chat, not registered nurses, but real ends in the chat. Know that country crock spread. It doesn't matter how cold that shit is. It's still it comes up in like little ripples as it goes up the knife. And you're like, <laughs> with each one, so you scrape your knife along that thing. Is, and you suddenly have this weird, like erection of country crock sticking up over the top of your knife. And you I know you know what I'm talking about because I know you're all fat. I know you did. Th I did this too. I never ate it with a spoon. That's disgusting. You eat it with a knife because you're pretending to make a sandwich. And you just get a couple of those things and eat. And all it tastes like is just fatty goodness. Oily. with a. It's like, is that milk? No, that isn't milk. Oh, but they tried. Oh my God, it's good. And they added sugar to compensate. <gasps> Country crocs. So that's what my parents bought. I grew up on Country crocs. I didn't even know butter was real because cows are fake because I grew up in India. I didn't. That's a joke. Um, love cows. Love to eat those. But I didn't know butter, like real butter existed, but people like use it in weird ways. Right? Country crock goes in the fridge. Butter goes on the goddamn counter in a butter dish where it stays soft like an old man. And you want that because you want to spread it on your bread or toast or pancakes or whatever. Mm waffles fucking like melting butter just puddles of it and you're like oh. you start sweating <sighs> oh it's like pulls the butter put cinnamon you can put powdered sugar in there put fruit if you're gay or you could just eat it with syrup and butter like a man god I fucking love waffles anyway I grew up with country crock spread. I marry Lady Raggins and she's like, I'm like, oh, we bought some butter. I guess I'll put it in the fridge until I have to use it in something. Because I used butter to cook stuff. I didn't put it on stuff because you put fake butter on stuff. Like Fabio. I can't believe it's not butter. Uh, that's what you did. And she's like, no, you idiot. Here's a dish. You put it on the counter. I'm like, if you put it on the counter, you're going to die. That's going to rot. No, it won't. It stays there forever. Doesn't stay there forever, but close. Funny thing is, we she flipped positions on that. Not on the butter, but on everything else. I'm like, this chicken sandwich I made is only 12 days old. If I put it in the air fryer, I can eat it and it'd be just fine. Like, little some people are gonna die. It's like just a chicken sandwich. Anyway, but she will put butter on the fucking counter for a month. Anyway, God, I fucking... Why did you tangent me on butter again? I don't know what a butter bell is. Uh, DJ82. Oh, DJI82. Breaking news, Nick Ricada claims Building 7 was brought down by butter dish in a microwave. Wasn't it? Do you think it wasn't? A Fed with insider knowledge said, that makes more sense than the official story. It does. It does. Because, actually though, Let's be honest. Let's be honest for a second. 
It was really just a fat chick falling out of one of the planes that hit Building 7. She was on fire, collapsed into Building 7. That thing was toast, which is why you butter it.